Hello, my name is Diana Salas Diaz. I am from Peru and I choose ASU because it's the top one university in innovation. I have a bachelor degree in tourism management administration in Peru and I have nine years of work experience in business development in different companies in Latin America, Canada and US. I was trying to find my life purpose or trying to align my life purpose with my career. So I decided that I need a master degree in US in order to achieve my future goals. When my mentor introduced me to ASU, I discovered that this university has a lot of diversity. 60% of students coming from different countries. In comparison between Boston and Toronto, the weather and the hiking activities that we have in Arizona foster my decision to come to ASU. Part of the requirement for Thunderbeer, my school in ASU, was to score 100 in TOEFL. At that time, I didn't have that score, so I was introduced by the university, by my ad admission advisor in Thunderbeer, the Global Lounge, especially the academic English course online. Before Global Lounge, I've never have written a research essay, and thanks to the three-month course, I learned how to build research essay, and it was an, uh, it was an amazing experience for me. It was uh, difficult, challenging, but I succeed. My writing was my weakest point, and I will always be grateful to the Global Lounge English Academic course because I developed my English academic writing because of this course. So I learned APA citation, I learned how to write a research essay, and actually I would like to mention that I wrote my first research essay thanks to this course as part of the homework of the course. I wrote a research essay about the negative effect of brain drain in developing countries. This is a topic that I am passionate about, and actually I published this article on my school in Thunderbeer, and um, it's connected to my purpose because I was looking to do a master program in US because I want to work in intersection between business and government in order to improve developing countries. I am very interested in economic development of developing countries. So writing this essay as part of my final exam in the Global Lounge was very meaningful to me. I don't think so, because Global Lounge build the bridge between my advanced English level to an academic level that ASU required. So that bridge was very difficult to me to, to, to walk through. And in the middle of TOEFL and my admission process, it was Global Lounge telling me, it's possible, Diana. You just need to take the course, immerse yourself in this three-month course, do your homework, read, be present, ask questions, finish all the modules, and you will succeed. And that's how I have my admission to Thunderbird at ASU. Ask for the Global Launch course, because honestly, I lost a lot of time uh, going to Canada, going to Boston, and spending a lot of time in English schools there. Um, I, I think I will change that and I will be just looking into academic English courses in the universities directly instead of looking for English courses outside of the universities. Trust the process. Set aside a free time for doing your homework and for study. Do all the assignments and always ask to the professor because you will have 24-7 uh, access to the professor and he, she will be helping you and try to do your best because it's a one-time opportunity that you can improve your English skills while being at home. From my experience in the online part, I will say that Global Lounge 
is gonna is making a huge impact worldwide because it allows students all over the world to take the classes. You can be anywhere and just with connection to internet and to a laptop, you can learn English and you can speed up the process of learning academic English to come to a graduate program in the US. So I definitely think Global Launch is making a huge impact because it's bringing high level English worldwide. I love my job at ASU right now. I see myself working here for the next five or 10 years. I love Phoenix, I love Arizona, I want to build my life here and um, my team currently is implementing a 40 million dollar project in Central America that uh, is looking to reduce gender-based violence and we're working different other opportunities uh, with USAID and we will be improving the life of people in Central America and this is my life. I love my job because as a Latin American international professional working in this team, I can help my team developing proposals to foster international development in Latin America.